want that one. Okay, that one sounds weird. Hello, everybody, and welcome. I miss you! Hmm? I hope you all are doing well. Let's do a read, huh? All signs read. Resonates cool. If not, boop your nose way it goes. I ain't worried about shit. You shouldn't either. And you best be careful because it might follow you home. Y'all, I need to get a soldering iron or something because what the pin in my left keeps popping like my knees and my back. Not my pussy or my ass. With the parts that I don't want to pop. It's fucking ridiculous. We got the lovers. Are we doing this long? Or yeah, we'll just do it long. It's been a couple days. Queen of Pentacles reverse. It's a situation. There's a bitch here. There's a bitch here. Like, sorry. Wants and wishes. Ace of Cups. Fears and rejections of someone missing an opportunity completely. I mean, they acted like they didn't want it, and now they're like, but I actually wanted it. Fears of rejections, two of onions, digging something up and then crying about it, because it's just like, oh my god. How's your start title end? The devil. Capricorn, you could be out here. The Queen of Pentacles is out here, too. You also be dealing with the Gemini. The energy and vibe with this vibe check is the Ten of Wands. Straight up done with it. I don't want to... Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm, 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 like, I'm tired of carrying this shit. Oh, my bad. Who's talking nonsense? Capricorn, are you talking nonsense? Why are you talking nonsense, bro? What's the matter? What happened? Who made you feel feelings and then got you pissed because you had to feel them feelings? What happened, Capricorn? What happened, baby? What happened? Who made you feel like you had feelings? I don't know. It, could, it, it doesn't have to be you. It can also be Virgo, Taurus. Gemini, but you know, like you got the card I usually pick as you, as well as your ass trying to get the fuck away from somewhere. What the fuck you doing? Like, sorry, that was a little bit creepy. My bad. Oh, wrong deck. What's the bullshit with this ten of wands reverse? Why is someone coming in like they're tired and they want to give up? They're rich, but they can't pay a bill. The fuck. There's a lover scenario here, and I'm not sure what the fuck is going. Whose relationship is this? Uh, could be dealing with a Gemini, yeah. But this was—I don't know. It could be a Gemini. I mean, a Gemini is just a flaky Capricorn. That's it. Like when the devil can't get to you, he usually sends a Gemini. So that kind of makes sense too. You got crickets as you walk by. But they're going with the flow. And the right they're also dried up and drained, this individual is. But they love each the moon and that. Oh, you gotta receive what you do with the stuff you bought since you love me so much. What the fuck is that about? Too many cooks, too little customers. This is the same motherfucker I was reading for you. When the fuck was it? Was that last night? It was probably last night. It was probably last night. Too many cooks, too little customers, too many people doing things, but too many people not needing that shit done. How did my leftovers taste? Said by a woman with saggy tatas that hates Pete and Pete, and no one in my arena hates Pete and Pete. This is someone outside the arena. This is someone I don't know who they are.
I don't know. It could be that same energy from, I think, last night. Like, what, the Ten of Swords was the vibe and energy? Like, someone was in a box and we got the Ten of Wands? Hmm. Interesting. What's with this lovers? This is, yeah, that's upright. What's with this lovers here? There's a good lady. Situation's Queen of Pentacles. It's about to convene with someone. Which is weird because it's like she's too focused on herself to notice that everyone else is dried up and drained. I guess someone has to sit down and have a conversation with her or something. Nigga, who is this? Why is someone... Wait... There's already a couple, and there's a good lady. But then there's a queen of pentacles down here. Sure, she's bitchy, but, like... That's default, so we can't count that. But she's extra today, so we can count that for the extraness. But it's like... Someone wants to sit and talk with her on a bench? But it's like she's too occupied with her own shit to notice that people are dying in front of her. She's just like, I got this great pentacle I need to focus on while everyone else is suffering. But someone wants to come have a conversation with her. Huh. Ace of Cups is the want and wish. Someone wants this. From someone with high honors. They're very studious. Smart. They're wearing, like, school stuff. The robe with the little hat and the tassel. Do, is it not weird that we as human beings have to name parts of a thing that already has a name? Like, I understand skeletons and shit, but why does each piece need a part in clothing? Like, why can't it just all be a onesie? Obstacle and challenge. Missing an opportunity on purpose, and then wishing you hadn't. Marriage? What? Nigga, I've been, I've been married for 10 years, you ain't missing nothing, I, I, I promise you. <laughs> like, marriage is a super duper difficult thing. Oh, someone wants to pre- Oh! It could be a Capricorn, but they're in total solid, like, don't mess with me. I don't feel like dealing with you people today. That, that like, that could be the thing, but they're extra miff, so it's like, you gotta wait, like, three months before you can talk to them right now, because they're that angry. <clears throat> But it seems like people need to t talk to her, or someone she needs to talk to, or I don't know. Because there is a good lady up here, but I don't know who that bitch is. Could be a Gemini, I don't know, but it's like, what do you want? They want to bring an Ace of Cups with the highest of honors. But it's almost like they want to make someone regret, possibly a Capricorn, um... Not being with them, not getting the marriage, and it's like... Sir, I, I'm too busy with my fucking pentacle to notice that people are dying, but you expect me to focus on marriage? Like, what? Which is crazy, because people are suffering. But someone wants to bring a cup of love with high honors, but I don't know who this is. Well, it's this queer who can't pay a bill. I mean, they're rich, but they can't pay a bill. They want to come in with love with high honors, but it's like... Why is the alternative to this is, like, it, it's like the only way they're going to make someone want this kind of marriage is to make them wish that they hadn't missed it. Trying to get, like, the devil. If this isn't a Capricorn. To venture that way, which is like... Mm. Like, I know he has snazzy clothes, but do you really want to be married to the devil? Like... 
even worse, a Capricorn. Do you know what it's like being with a Capricorn? Especially if you're another Capricorn. Capricorns are so mean to each other. And I have learned this time and time again. Like, I don't know what it is about male Capricorns, but they have a horrible habit of leading people on. And then, like, acting upset that a person could still want to, like, be cool with them. or And worse, they don't even want to be friends with them. But it's just like... Sir, you have mommy issues and you're more sensitive than me and I'm the one with the vagina. Like, I don't know what it is about male Capricorns sometimes. It's just like, it's like they should have been the females of the Zodiac and we should, and we, we, we female Capricorns should have been the males because it's like, <sighs> I'm so much more manly than a male Capricorn. Oh my God, at least I could get my feelings hurt without getting all sensitive about it, you know? Fairs of rejections, digging something up and, and finding something to cry about. A good outcome? What? A fear of rejection? Is someone afraid of, like, making a decision about what's going to make them cry, their feelings, what's going to make them sad? Did someone turn out a... A bitch they like? Is that what it, is that what this is? This one trying to coax Capricorn's attention or Gemini's attention? Like I'm in love with a good lady. Oh, okay. What's with the devil reverse? How this shit starts? How it'll end? Like uh, uh, the fucking devil sneaking away? The Capricorn's trying to get away. You better catch that motherfucker. main character could be a male then could be a man so this is like who's probably dishonest as, yeah okay maybe this is a capricorn after all <laughs> like i'm sorry to a lot of male capricorns and i know y'all ain't the same but in my lifetime i've had i don't have a lot of problem with female capricorns I don't know, my mom used to tell me, like, men don't mature till six months after death, and I thought that was really fucked up, right? And then, I met male Capricorns, and I realized, no, 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 my mother had to have dated a Capricorn in order to come up with that, because that's the only way, like, I, I don't know what it is about male Capricorns, but it's like... They're just... They're like little girls. They're like little. I, I can't explain it better than that. It's like they're, they, it's like they're women and men with penises. Who want to be like gay porn stars? I never understood. And the worst part is, is like they'll invite you. What I've noticed with a lot of them into like, like I had this one friend and she was dating a Capricorn, right? This guy acted like he was so into her, pursued her for like a year, and then as soon as he got the pussy, he was gone. She was like, I don't understand, we were getting along so well. This dude had been running the entire time just because he wanted to gain the victory, which is scary, right? Because Capricorns are fucking patient as fuck. Like, we got the patience of fucking Job. And he waited. It was like... Oh yeah, I, c I don't want one of those. No, I don't want one of those. I don't even want a female one, because they'll probably end up being evil as fuck. No. Then I ended up with a female anyway, and, and she was still evil as fuck. But still. Learned many things. Then again, this is why I'm happy I have an Aquarius moon. <laughs> it's had rising position. Because at least I know I'm fun. At least I know in Vedic I'd definitely be a Sagittarius, so... Or no, what, what's that one sign? That 13th one? What the fuck is that? Because I guess I'm supposed to be that if I were to follow it, but I don't know what the fuck it is. It's like an oaf. Oaf. Otifus? Or so, I don't fucking know what it's called. I don't know. I don't, I don't adhere to that one anyway, because it's just like, I don't know what that is, and I'm too old to, like, change my ways. Leave me alone. Like I'm 36 and my lower back is killing me. Leave me alone. Not as bad as last year. But still.
Mm, that was a thought. Anyway, what's with this lovers in regard to a good lady? Someone's snatching the treats from that bitch. She's too fat. Oh, someone's putting somebody on a diet. Oh, thanks for someone's dad. I'm sorry. I'm just automatic. I, like, switch right there. It's just like, oh, there's a man in this reading. And he believes women should be submissive. And yet he isn't husband material. We're going with that one today. Huh? This isn't even fuck boy. This is like, well, it could be the fuck boy. But I don't see the fuck boy getting in a relationship like last night, but I'm not sure. So I hope this is a continuing thing because I'll be so annoyed. A big book and a small book. Someone's all tired. They wore themselves out. It's like, <laughs> like all tired and shit. Um, the other person's too blind to see the toy about how someone's wearing themselves out, and they still continued going. This other person patiently drank out of their water bowl. This person accepted the pets until, like, you know, this person finally arrived at a crossroads. Now, an individual was kind of scared to follow the bird. Um, they weren't paying attention to how the other person was playing, how they had all these bowls and options in front of them, how they were fucking comfortable. But then, they started barking at a cat. The moon revealed secrets, and apparently someone was hounding someone with another dog behind them, but I don't think they realized it. You know, this was a lover situation that someone should have started. However, my problem is the Ten of Wands up here is, uh, reverse. Yeah, it's reverse. They're rich and they can't pay a bill, so it's like... It's, it's like someone ran themselves ragged. They wear themselves out too much. Now they want to release this. So they're just like, no more treats for you. But there's bullshit in that. Hmm. Why? Someone can't make a choice. What the fuck is going on? So, like, was there a relationship where someone just decided, you know what, I'm just gonna start over with somebody else. Like, let me take this stuff back. Because the truth of the matter is they couldn't decide. I don't think they know what they want, or didn't know what they wanted. The person on the other side had good judgment. <clears throat> what the fuck is that about? Or did they just want to wait and see until what their judgment perked up? Oof. Mm. So I want to take a leave of faith to a Queen of Cups, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, also Aries. They want to take a leave of faith to a lady, maybe, or a queen. I'm not sure. Someone who's nice, someone who's cuddly, someone who has their foot sticking out, and it's the most adorable fucking thing in the entire world. Queen of Pentacles up, right? What the fuck? So it starts out with the situation being the queen of pentacles in reverse and everyone's dying around her and shit because she's too focused on herself and someone needs to come talk to her. About herself though and I'm just like, wait, what? Is this, like, is this, like, there has to be two Capricorns. Or something. Or someone with strong Capricorn in their chart and Gemini in their chart. One of the two. Because it's like, why is she solving the puzzle? But this bitch is over here, crack a -lack. Maybe someone's being like, you gotta fix yourself. You gotta figure out what's going on with you. So she's a digging, right? Someone isn't helping filling the bowls, though. Once again, the four of bowls reverse. I'm like, make them wish that, like, they hadn't pissed me off in order to get fit. Which is like, is that why she's searching? 
Is she miffed? Is she... For justice! Yes, yes she is. Yes she is. Mm. Like looking back being like, okay, what made me mad this time? Ooh, someone took a leap of faith trusting someone who was sneaky. That's what it was. Someone who was threatening and all this. What the fuck? What happened? Someone's got a queen of pentacles sitting here thinking like, what was it that made me the most angry at this point? What was it that got to me the most? Does she need to have a conversation with someone? Did she feel like she bit someone's hand too much? I feel like, hmm. Which weirds me out. It's just like, if she's really in this energy, because when she's reversed in this deck, it's like she's too focused on herself. People are asking her to feed her because, you know, those are her kids. And she's just like, I raised you to be independent. I am not responsible for feeding you. I gave you life. Let the flame in you burn to survive. And it's like, but mommy, I'm only two. You know, it's one of those. It's, it, it's like someone's too much. And it's like someone wants to, to, like, have to go sit and talk to her and, like, get her to figure out, you know, like, what made her bite a hand. But at the same time, this is justice. This is justified. The way she's behaving. So it's like... Hmm. Oh, that's a weird drum. Whatever. Because someone didn't fill the empty bowl. She's been searching, and it's just as to bite somebody because they didn't give me what I wanted or what I needed. Oh. Is someone being a mirror, Capricorn? Especially if you got Capricorn as Venus like I do. Because, uh, you look at every ounce of love you give as an exchange, a business deal. It's not like you mean to, but it's more like, you know, like, you know, if I give you this kind of energy, I'm expecting the same back from you. And if you don't give it back to me, or worse, you take my energy, abuse it, and then I realize that's what you're doing. What the fuck? I have no idea what the fuck that was. Um... But it's like, if I give you so much energy and you take it from me, but you don't even, like, reciprocate the, yeah, that music, the very basics of it, it's like, I'ma be a cunt. And I will. I will. Oh my god, I will. It, it, there was nothing that sets fire to each and every hair around the circle, which is my asshole, than, uh, giving my energy away to somebody and caring about somebody only to find out they never gave a fuck about me to begin with. Which, you know, that tends to have terrible effects on people, especially if it, if I put in a lot. Like, if I, if I put in a lot. Mmm. Maybe that's why she's mad. Maybe that's why Capricorn's creep. It could be a Capricorn creeping to the main character, being like, "I'm slit this motherfucker's throat." You watch me. I'm gonna fuck him up. You done lead yeed your last haul, motherfucker. Uh. Oh dear. Yeah. Maybe she wants to like let someone know how she feels. She might want to let someone know how she feels. No. No. I gently dipped my paw in this before I decided I didn't want to play with it anymore. You jacked everything and left, motherfucker. And then, you know, I'm just sitting here waiting, contemplating, should I just keep chewing on this box or should I go ahead and, like, work on getting the treats one at a time? Mm. I feel like someone's upset. Oh, okay. Whoever it is, they ran to avoid death. 
the other motherfucker know they have a toy, but it's not really as much a demonstration of strength as it is, um... I want for my big day is a big booty hole, but inside they're crying because they have no one to actually cuddle with. And every time they get in their feelings, it's just they, like a bucket gets stuck on their head. Mm. One more on this situation. Oh. Someone left somebody else with nothing once they hit their crossroads. That's an issue. That is an issue. Maybe that's why they're coming back with all these fucking sticks, being like, I can't... I'm rich in spirit, even though I can't pay for nothing. No, motherfucker, that, I don't think that's the issue. <clears throat> like, someone carries judgment. <clears throat> you know? They felt justified biting somebody because they refused to give them anything once they hit a crossroads. Like, I don't know what this person was trying to figure it out anyway. Uh, I'm not sure if someone's uh, guides, people's folks they talk to when they're alone and shit. I don't know who the fuck you talk to. God, whatever. Um, I don't know. If um... Y'all, this feels like your peoples. If this is you or someone's peoples, told someone to back the fuck off. Or someone snatched things back from somebody? Because they didn't know what was going on. I'm not sure, because it feels like someone's kind of retaliating on this, but not doing anything. They're just being bitchy about it, and it's just like, why are you bitchy? Because mm. they ain't been fed since May, and that's what's pissing them off. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, wants and wishes with an individual. Bring a cup of love like it's a high honor. It just feels like someone's really stuck on themselves, not in a good way. So person's going to be looking at this situation like mm, there is a foundation here these are goldfish treats these are special treats he's saying pretty things with butterflies and shit I is it to see if he gets at least one pentacle like if I get him to look in my direction I know I'm doing good oh This is like, give me a chance. Just give me that one pentacle. It'll help me ease my anxiety. Mm. And it's all the same fucking cat. That's the fucked part for me. <laughs> That's the messed up part for me. Oh, but the other person sees it. They see the foundation of this. They already know. They already know that someone's going to come in, I assume, spinning some type of truth in order to get one pentacle to alleviate themselves. some bullshit because that made me forget exactly what I was gonna say no 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 I remember fuck you okay this person already knows what's gonna happen you know this um love with the high honors why are you coming in with love with the high honors and gotten a person looking at the, the treats like it's a foundation it's like what what are you doing I don't understand 
why is it that like you want to come in with this love but all it does is result in someone giving you one piece and it helps alleviate your like what's gonna happen if, 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 if that happens what happens if they give you relief from your um anxiety whoever this is <clears throat> They won't have... The fuck? What's with that? Like, what is with people not wanting people to at least have a little victory? This person is just victorious. And I guess all of the hard work you put into wearing yourself out was worth it? But this person... That this person's too young or blind to see the toy that will take them away from the shit. And you can easily come up and lap the water. Slowly with temperance. Until they are dead. Fishy. Ha ha ha. Mm. This person's got a lot of high hopes. Considering. Mm, obstacles and challenges. Making someone you regret yalling together, I guess. But someone put their paw in the hand and was just like, you know, I I, I wanna play with the water, but nah. Nah, I don't I don't wanna play with this emotion. In order to stall their energy. And make them too scared to go in a different direction. What? This seriously feels like the fuck boy again. I think it is. Then look at the. Like you look like they fall in the toilet. Oh my god, this idiot's gonna be emotional. This idiot's gonna be emotional. This idiot, like. Mmm. If this person had a fit in front of the person they want's attention, like, literally have a total mental breakdown. You know, because a Gemini could totally have a full mental breakdown, crying and blabbering, and they will still be lying to your face. Capricorn could probably do it too, but only if they're a sociopathic narcissist would... Like, I can't tell if this is all imagined in the person's head or an actual scenario, because, you know, they're rich. But it's not with money, so it's like, what, 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 what's in your, what's in your wallet? No, what's in your brain? That, like, f fuck the wallet. What the fuck is going on with your mind? If somebody wants to come in to alleviate a burden after they've worn themselves out with the burdens, like, I don't understand what this person did. But that's what's also giving me this whole vibe of like, is this really the fuck boy that I read for last night? Because this is starting to look like, feel like completely different. It's like, like someone's wearing themselves out doing something, but it's like they don't know they're tired. You know, you know that point when you like been up for so long that like you're no longer tired. You're just giggling. Wide awake. You know you're sleep deprived, but it's too late now. You ain't going to sleep for another 12 fucking hours. You, you've you hit your fucking third wind at this point. That kind of thing. Like, if you've ever worked a graveyard shift, because that's normally what I would work. Um, if I didn't have to be in the daylight with the day fucking walkers, uh, I would literally be working a graveyard shift. I've always preferred working a graveyard shift. People are asleep. I don't got to talk to nobody. Very rarely that others will be night walkers with me. And it's quiet, and I can do things I normally couldn't do in the daytime, because people be everywhere, and they're annoying as shit. But it's like, 
Mm, once you like got to a certain point after you've been awake for so long. It's like. I can't go to sleep right now. And like the penguins are giggling in my head. And they're telling really good jokes. But I don't know Spanish. You know at that point you're just too tired. You're too tired to um, really focus. But you're, you're too aware and awake to fall asleep. And now you're on your 18th cup of coffee. And you, and you might as well go another three days. Because you're already here. Also you've never suffered insomnia. That's like kind of normal for me sometimes sometimes i'll just go without sleep i've been doing that since i was a little kid though um, my mother doesn't sleep like a human being so i inherited that from her so i've been blessed with the ability to just go without sleep if necessary a lot of people don't operate really well without it though thank goodness i was given the dna to handle that but it's like also the military help too because once you like you spend three days as a as a guard like 72 hours straight you gotta learn how crazy you can get and it's just like all right i've already been down this road before and i don't feel like having to stab a bear with a with, with a, a three inch blade oh that's a fucking tree okay well i'm not going to that's great which by the way don't ever drink energy drinks if you haven't slept for three days you're gonna hallucinate like a motherfucker i did my oh my imagination went nuts uh but it's like with this scenario it's like some like i don't i can't tell if someone's not getting enough sleep and that's why their brain ain't working because that's what it kind of feels like it's like someone's surprised they work themselves to the bone they aren't functioning the way that they should um if you look at them, you would think that they're on drugs, but after you talk to them, it's just, oh no, they're actually tired. Girl, you need a nap. I'll get you a blanket, a bottle, I don't know, but you need to go to bed or something, because you're making me sleepy. That's what it's like, someone's wearing themselves out too much. But I can't tell if it's because they want to hurt. And like, are they trying to do this to hurt somebody? Is that what's happening? Am I, am I, like, am I fuck? Am I, am like, am I fully my, like, oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is, yeah, it is. Ah, oh, and, and, ooh. Oh, my. Seven of Claws. Seven of Toys reverse. Also, the Seven of Swords and the Seven of Wands reverse. Hmm. Well, that answers that question. I don't think this is the fuck boy, because this is like, okay, this starts to make sense, but the more I'm looking at it, it's like there's nothing really emotional here. So it's like, it's fucking, it's like, it could be someone also fucking with someone about their emotions too, or even talking about them, but it's like they've done so much at once that they used up all the toys and now they got nothing else to knock over. Like, it's like, oh, this is my master plan. I'll shoot it all at them at once instead of, like, you know. I don't know. It's like, what are you doing? <laughs> There's a rejection. The two of wands digging up onions to make something cry. Good outcome. Like, is someone trying to blackmail someone? What the fuck? <clears throat> the fool taking a leap of faith here. Someone is. So someone's taking a leap of faith to break it off somewhere, either with a partnership, a relationship, something like that. Just to leave someone starved since May, as they were already. And someone wearing a cone just to headbutt somebody like a turtle, rather than protect their neck. What the fuck does that even mean? Okay, you guys can't be telling me random stuff. But not even think about what the fuck you're gonna say before you give it to me. 
One of y'all's new and you're slow. You're not used to my speed. That's okay, but I'm just letting you know. You gotta think about what you're gonna say before you, like, you put it in my head so I can repeat it out. Because it's like, that confuses the shit out of me. And I don't know who... Oh, my bad, dude. I didn't know you were learning. Okay, my bad. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to, like, insult you. I'm, like, I'm glad you're learning the language, but it's, like... I didn't know. My bad. I Like, where did... What the fuck? Where did you come from? Where the fuck is that at? Okay, whatever. <clears throat> Either way. Mmm... The music's slightly appropriate, too. Um... Hmm... Someone wants... To, I'd like someone wants to separate from someone that's the fear of rejection. But at least someone feeling starved since May. What? The fuck? Who's Layla? Who's Layla? Okay, whatever. Now someone's just going la la la. It's like, what? Oh, they got their fingers in her ear. <laughs> Just singing like la 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 la, like ah, oh, I can't hear you. I don't give a shit. You ate, feed yourself. You have thumbs. No, I don't have a cat. Well, I got a cone. I'm also not listening to you. I don't. Mmm. Does someone feel like they're not gonna be heard though? Because this did start out with the good lady up here in this lover snare. Could have been a Gemini. Does someone feel like they're getting punished by a lover? Or by somebody they're close with? Because someone is snatching stuff away based on a lie that they don't know what to do even though they seem to have judgment. Or they have exacted judgment. I don't know. Anyway, how does shit start? How it'll end? The devil is escaping. Possibly the main character could be a man with a man bun. Coming in straight for the bullshit. Not even, like, getting asked the question to not bring that bullshit in. No, they're going in just to start shit. Just to cause rumors. Just to say whatever. What? Who is this? It could be an air side, definitely Gemini, but it's like, why is coming someone coming in here just starting drama? <laughs> like, that's what it feels to me. It's like someone's coming in to start some gossip. I guess they just want to uh, alleviate some shit and make some... What? I'm so confused. Yeah, bitch didn't eat today, did she? Hmm. Cause it was all false and she don't like it. Oh, but the King of Pentacles reversed as well. He just ate all that shit and got his face stuck. Now he's running around the neighborhood like a tube cat. Scared. And the devil reversed on the top of the deck. So I had to take a bite. Mm. 
It's like someone came in to try to ruin the other person's good day. Thinking they were going to eat, and, they, and now they're not. The, the fish is rotting, they don't want to touch it, they're crying in their plate, you know? It's like, um... Mm. <laughs> it's like they were coming to look at gossip on a motherfucker and they found nothing like a waste of energy because they wasted their time I feel like mm. my question here is Who's the shittier person? You know? Because I don't know who's worse between these motherfuckers. Yeah, it's nice. Nobody wants to hear that, though. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear that. Oh my god. Someone's gonna piss their pants. They're gonna wish they had a pad. Um... Mm. I'm honestly not sure what to make of this. Like, are these people even lovers? Are they even official? Because it seems like they're playing games between the two of them. You know? It's like a really gross relationship. You know? But I can't tell. But I don't know if they're actual lovers lovers or if it's just a partnership. Or a friendship, or family, or I don't know, but it's like, they're close. I think they're closer than what they should be, but it's like... They're really terrible for each other. It's like Liz and Big Ed. This is like Liz and Big Ed and their relationship. You know, at first you felt bad for Liz, right? Because Ed's a piece of shit. But then Liz decided that she's gonna do, like, the whole, um codependent thing and start behaving in a way that like assists in the toxic behaviors and actions and reactions between the two of them like oh my god they have a whole other season coming up i totally forgot these motherfuckers existed it's been a year but it's like i can't i don't know if they're married or whatever yet liz is doing burlesque dancing on stage and talking to other bitches. At some point, Ed accuses her of being a lesbian because someone else was on top on her. And it's just like, wait, how is she a lesbian? The lesbian's not... Well, wait. No, because that requires men to know how that even works to begin with. So that doesn't even work right there. But... <clears throat> mm. There is a significant event gonna happen. Dealing with a fucking oh, they, of course there's a rat. I mean, it's a mouse, but I call it a rat because it's it's the same thing. It's just smaller. Faith is going to be tested. The clarity of feelings is going to pa is going to come to pass. Like it's not passing, but it's coming to pass. But someone ain't going nowhere. Cause they committed. Did it think that the feelings won't go somewhere? Or... I don't know, but someone's gonna have it with a rat. Someone's faith is gonna get tested. The neuro emotions are no longer gonna be clouded, but it's like they can't go anywhere because there's a commitment or a promise or something, and it's just like... Like, huh, what? Did you marry somebody who you shouldn't have or something? And now you realize, oh no, this isn't the person I wanted at all. 
For love of God, don't be one of those people. Especially if you're a man who ends up with someone you don't even want. Better yet, don't sit there and waste someone's time. If you're not going to be the kind of person they want. But then get mad when they want to go look for the person that would be best for them. You know, like, that's what I'm picking up here. It's just like... It's... Like, it almost feels like... <clears throat> it's almost like someone picked up the wrong person. Which I think is what I'm going to name this one. Now I got games and shit. Now they're doing nothing but playing, like, uh, the Liz and Big Ed game. Where it's like, nobody wants them together. But they finally found a person both of them have. Who helps encourage the bullshit. That they keep walking in with, you know? Without even being asked, they just automatically do it. It's like, I don't know, they're, like, it's just weird. It's weird. It's weird. Anyway, that's the reading for tonight. Please, for the love of God, tell me this ain't y'all, because this is just... <laughs> like, I'm so exhausted from this, like, I'm ready to go to bed, and it's, like, hella early, and it's like, uh... Oh. Mm, for realsies. Anyway, um, you guys, I love your face. You be safe. You stay suspicious. I don't know. I feel like this is going to be the one time yet. Like, I know a lot of us, myself included, are just like, you know, like, Lord, I don't ask for much. I don't even want money. Just giving me somebody who I can have a fun ass time with who won't try to, like, control me. Or expect me to act a certain way. I, I would appreciate that, Lord. You know, like, some of us are just, We just want someone we can chill with. And occasionally they'll touch our butt. That's all we're looking for, right? But I feel like if, if you're around... Whoever this with is... Is... And, um... They are a couple... You're gonna end up thanking God that you're not in a relationship. I, I swear, because this feels... It feels like this is going to be something that's going to make you like... You know what? I don't... The Lord has me single for a reason. And who am I to question the Lord? You know, you're going to be going into that shit with this. And so if you end up seeing this, I don't know. But it's like... Hmm. Hmm. Y'all be safe. Love your face. Bye-bye.